Hey everybody, it's Owen the Nuts Gremlin, and today I'm showing you some customs and just some fix-ups. Uh, one like fantasy attire, I don't know, just some stuff that I'm going to be showing you today. And that you, you can try at home, because why not? So, uh, let's just, let's just get into the basic stuff first, so why not? So here is my custom diesel. This came, this head scan came in a battle pack. With uh, Shawn Michaels, here's the battle pack figure, and um, I don't know. I guess I kind of like the uh, head on that more than this head. Mm -hmm. Looks looks okay, but um, I don't know. I just thought this would be a better head for it, cause why not? And uh, this is pretty uh, sick Diesel Hall of Fame figure. It came with the Intercontinental. Uh, Championship and everything, glasses and everything, but um, it was just a simple head swap. That was pretty much it. Tattoos are pretty much the same, and I think there's just a little more color in this one, just a little more red. I don't know. Everything, almost about them, is the same except one basic, one's elite, and the tank tops are different. But um, I don't know. It's just a simple little head swap that you guys could do to make your diesel a lot better. This is just my opinion, guys. You could do whatever you want. I don't really care. So, let's, let's get into the next thing. Okay, so next up, we have a Shawn Michaels custom fix-up little thingy here. Sorry if you guys see that thing swinging. It's my TLC thing. I keep hitting it. And, um, I was gonna add knee pads to this, but when I tried to pop the boots off... I just felt like this leg was going to break. I will eventually add knee pads to it, but you know, just to make it a little better. Now, this head scan came from the battle pack that came along with the diesel. And, um... And, uh, here's the original head scan on the, uh, I think Elite Legends figure. It was re-released. Here's the, uh, head re-released. Re I don't know. I just didn't see, like, Shawn Michaels in it. I know we wore this, but like, I just, I don't know. I thought this head was a little better, but it sits high on the peg, so I might switch the peg. I'm not too sure yet. Not too sure about that one, but again, my opinion, I think this figure's awesome. And I'm eventually gonna get the, uh, I think they made a Toys R Us exclusive Elite of something like this, so I might just switch the knee pads and then this head onto it. Just to make that custom, you know, Royal Rumble attire. Because I think he won the Rumble in this attire, too. So, that's, that's pretty cool. Okay, and the next figure that we have here is... Sorry for any background noises, guys. It's just this custom AJ Styles Elite 56. Now, this head scan I got from the basic series something red attire AJ Styles this was the original head on the Elite 56 that was the head that was doing the uh, red AJ Styles now uh, since it came on the blue attire this head I'm thinking about just swapping it with this one just to make it like accurate but uh, I just think this look this is my favorite AJ Styles head scan I just think it looks so much better it just everything about it just just looks better. Just I don't know. I just feel like it's better than Scream Head Scan. And the reason why I didn't like this one is because I just feel like it's way too small. I like how they're giving us the new hair. It feels like rubbery and stuff. But I just feel like it's way way too small. I don't I don't know. Like compared to like this one, like I just feel like it's small. Like I don't I don't know. It's a Think of it, I just feel like it's small. So, like, you know. So, that's one other little custom fix-up that you can do. Uh, here we got another one. Just a simple head swap here. It's the, uh, Then Now Forever Sami Zayn. I switched this with the, uh, basic Sami Zayn head. And, uh, this was the original head. I don't know. I just feel like it looked kind of like plain, you know, like, no emotion, I mean, it's better than the new head that they just put out, 
I feel like there's no, like, emotion or anything in it. It's just kind of like, hmm. just plain. Like, he's not smiling or anything. This one, he's like, yeah, yeah, let's go, let's go. You know, it looks like Sammy Zane. You know, I like the attire and everything. Like, it looks, it's cool. I might take the Elite 51 and just throw this head on it, maybe. Who knows? I don't know what I'll do, because I'm crazy. I'll do anything. Uh, let's see here. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying. Everything is just falling apart on me. Um, okay, this one. This one's a long story. So here we have an NXT attire Tyson Kid. So my Tyson Kid Elite. Its leg broke off, like, badly, like, the ball was stuck in it. So, <laughs> I saw, I was watching, like, a little, you know, like, long, long ago NXT. And I saw Tyson Kidd in the, these, these long pants. I'm like, ah, crap. I'm like, hey, I have a broken Tyson Kidd. Your arms and head are still fine. I'll just throw that crap onto this uh, Defining Moments Jericho that I'm not even using. So... Here's the defining moment's Jericho head. I don't know where his arms are. They all look the same. Defining moment's Jericho head. And I just, I, I put it all together. And I'm like, oh crap, that looks pretty good. I was going to switch the boots, but I just couldn't get them off. So it does say Jericho on the sides. But I don't know. I don't really notice it. I could care less. So, yeah. Happens. Okay, now we're getting into a little more complex ones, so to say, that I did. So, I have this fantasy attire, Zack Ryder. Now, I know, I'm, trying, I'm working on a little, I'm trying to maybe start getting into painting and paint over this. I don't know, I'm not too sure. I really do like the purple, but, um, here, I'll show, I'll show you my formula for this. So, uh, this was actually a uh, Neville from Elite Series. I have no clue, and uh, this is just the Neville head that was on it. And these were like the Neville arms, and then I took. I forget what I uh, took from it. See, now I have the uh, Hypros Battle Pack, and I didn't have any more Zack Ryder heads that looked like this, and I didn't want to use this one. Like that one's just like, Ew. it's like young Zack Ryder. I don't want young Zack Ryder, so we. Did a little dismantling. Yeah, yeah, it's like chicken body now. And uh, I winded up just throwing the old Zack Ryder head onto the Hype Bros attire. So I can still have a Hype Bros Zack Ryder and then have a regular Zack Ryder. And boy, does it pop when you put the Intercontinental title on here. Let's wrap, let's wrap it around his waist. Now, if it was the white one, that would be uh, pretty dope. Throw it on him. Yeah, why not? Why not? Just throw the Intercontinental to title on him. Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? All right. Now let's get into probably my favorite custom on this list. I'm pretty proud of it. I left all this crap in the ring. Right. I'm pretty proud of this custom. I really like it. It's a custom elite Johnny Gargano. I saw people using a more Miz body for it, I guess. I don't know, which, you know, classic, like, kind of skinny body. But I felt like he was a little more buff than that. So, I put, I did a Damien Miz now body. Really, I only did the arms, and then the head, and then the, the knee pads, and then, like, the kick pads. So here's the Damien Miz now kick pads and Damien Miz now head. And then this is what happened to the basic. Another chicken body. Now, since it was basic kick pads, they didn't have all this like little indentations. It was just like a hole. Just a hole. So that's why I'm glad that he had long knee pads because it kind of covers up the fact that all this like little, uh, I don't know, extra stuff on there is there. But if you just slide it down, can't see it whatsoever. And it looks fine, you know, like if you're posing him. Not gonna notice, like, you're fine. You know, like, posing him or something, you're fine. Can't see it at all. The knee pads hide it. So, if you guys like this video, please leave a comment. 
uh, subscribe, turn on your notifications bell so you will be notified whenever I make a new video. Look out for new toy hunts. I will be going to Walmart sometime this weekend. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.